Well, I think in certain situations, there's an expectation of what we should be creating as African-American artists. In my past, growing up um, where I grew up and actually deciding I wanted to make art, I felt for marketing purposes that myself as an African-American artist and me expressing myself to the rest of the world, whether it's the white populace or black populace, they would understand me better if I focus solely on the fact that I was African-American within my art. So I touched on that in high school, and then in college I touched on that. But then again, I found the words I was trying to express about the black experience, or what I thought the black experience should be stated about, in through my art, was not authentic. It was it was very, it was very uh, 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 cate uh, strategically calculated, and it was just not full of soul. And uh, these paintings were great, but what ended up happening, my message was misconstrued with me having this passion, this desire to express color, to express my emotion through joy. So whatever I was trying to say about what I thought I was gonna say about my experience as African-American was diluted. But in the end, when I realized, looking, searching for within of who I am and my own personal experiences of where I grew up, how I was raised, it became more universal. So my voice, my true African-American voice is based in abstraction, which to me is plenty black enough.